Praise be Jesus Christ. Today is Holy Thursday. One of the things we celebrate on Holy Thursday is the institution of the priesthood. Now, St. Padre Pio died in 1968, and they say he was God's response to the silly ideas that were being introduced in his time. At the time of St. Padre Pio, there were those within the church who were suggesting that we should do away with the priesthood as we know it. And St. Padre Pio showed us that no, the priesthood is, is a great gift from God. It's a mystery. It's holy. There were those in the time of St. Padre Pio who were saying, oh, we shouldn't focus so much on the, the suffering and the passion and the death of our Lord Jesus. St. Padre Pio had the miraculous stigmata. For years and years and years, he, he shed blood. For years and years, the, the, the wounds of Christ visible on his body, reminding us that, no, we need to look to him who was pierced so that we can be purified, so that we can grieve over our sin and be healed and saved. We must always keep in mind and in our heart the, 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 the wonderful sacrifice of love that Jesus uh, offered for us in his suffering, his pa passion, and his death, which led to his resurrection. There were those in the time of St. Padre Pio who were saying, you know, the Mass it really isn't that important. Confession really isn't that important. And St. Padre Pio, the center of his ministry, was indeed celebrating the holy sacrifice of the Mass. And he celebrated with great devotion. It was, it was a, a tremendous testimony to, to the, the, the power of the Mass, just seeing St. Padre Pio celebrate the Mass. And he, he heard confessions for hours and hours, showing that confession is, is one of the sacraments. It's, it's, it's the way God wants to forgive our sins and make us, make us new. And so it's important, especially today, as we have new waves of silly thinking, new waves of people within the church who want to do away with the priesthood as we know it. Uh, we need to resist these, these um, ideas in the church. We need to look to the saints. If you want to understand the priesthood, if you want to learn about the priesthood, look first of all at the sacred scripture, look to the doctors of the church throughout the ages, and look to the recent saints. Look to St. Padre Pio. If you want to learn about the priesthood, look, look at St. Padre Pio. Look at St. John Vianney, the Curé of Ars. Look at even what wonderful saints and mystics have written about the priesthood. St. Faustina, one day she was in the hospital. She wanted to go to confession and a seraph, an angel, appeared to her. And she said, I said to the seraph, could you perhaps hear my confession? And he answered me, no spirit in heaven has that power. And it's an indication of the great power that's given um, by the Lord Jesus to the priests to minister to God's people. So, so please pray. Pray for us priests today uh, on this day and uh, be assured of our prayers. Viva Cristo Rey.